What's on YouTube? It's Pete TT back at it with another Destiny 2 video. Today, guys, we are talking about Lord Saladin and the Iron Banner. Obviously, uh, I think it's safe to say we could all assume that Iron Banner would come back at some point and in some kind of fashion. But until now, we didn't know what. Obviously, there's been a few leaked images that have shown like the Destiny 2 directory with the competitive, the casual and the Iron Banner option there available. But now we have a little bit more information to go on. So in the description down below, you will find a link to a Reddit post and you will find a link to Destiny Tracker uh, where it actually lists all the quests in Destiny 2. The reason this is, is because uh, the Iron Banner global quest line actually appeared recently. So of course we can now talk about that. Um, I might pull up some images if I can actually get them to download properly guys in the background why I am talking. But basically there is going to be an Iron Banner questline. And obviously guys, as I said, although this appears in the Destiny Tracker uh, quest page now, um, this isn't all the information. You know, there could be things that we still don't know and are missing. That being said, in a couple of hours this week at Bungie will actually go live. So possibly some more information to come later. And if that's the case, I'll of course uh, bring you an updated video. But we know there is going to be an Iron Banner questline that starts off with meeting Lord Saladin, okay? And the objectives for this are speak with Lord Saladin at the Iron Banner grounds beneath the Traveller. Now, it says beneath the Traveller, but it doesn't actually say where it is. Is that in the tower? Is it just outside the tower? Will it be in the farm? Is this a new area we don't know yet? Honestly... I don't know. Some people have said that it will be in the tower. Some people are saying like, no, it, it can't be in the tower. Maybe it's outside. But again, guys, we, we don't know yet. We are just guessing. But I would love to know your thoughts in the comment section down below. Now, we also know there are going to be several different emblems that come with the Iron Banner questline. We have Lens of Fate, which is a basic Iron Banner emblem. And we have the Shades of Radagast. This is a legendary engram. And of course, we have the Fell Winter Frost. Again, another legendary emblem. Now, knowing how emblems are working currently in Destiny 2, I would assume that these could possibly show maybe your Iron Banner kill death or kill assist death it could show how many matches you've won I, I don't know but I, I definitely think that they will have some sort of number on them where it keeps track of some particular Destiny 2 stat related to Iron Banner Anyway, as I said, uh, the quest line will start off with meeting Lord Saladin and talking to him. We also know that there are going to be challenges in Iron Banner, okay? And these will actually replace the, the uh, bounties that we had in Destiny 1 for Iron Banner. And basically when you complete three challenges in the Iron Banner event, you will get a reputation bundle. And of course you hand these reputation bundles into Saladin in exchange for loot. Now... We also know that obviously you can't buy gear anymore, so um, I would imagine that would stay the same with Iron Banner. I can't see them changing it again to go back to a Destiny 1 style way, although I would personally like that, uh, for Iron Banner. So I would imagine it will be the same. It will be a case of play a load of games, do a, a, a load of challenges, get some reputation tokens, hand them in, um, level him up and get yourself some loot. It'll all be RNG based and I would imagine that one week there will be a certain amount of things and the, the next month uh, that comes around, Iron Banner comes around again, it will be a, a different loot pool or maybe they will just have a loot pool for a particular season and the next season will have a different loot pool because again, we also know that there are going to be various seasons in the Iron Banner. Um, so again... As I said, when you've uh, done your Iron Banner challenges and you go back and you get your reputation bundle, you basically carry on playing and the next day and the next day and the next day you will get even more tokens for different challenges. Now again, as I said guys, um, this week at Bungie is a couple of hours away, so I'm hoping that we get some more information. But I just wanted to keep you up to date and let you know, Iron Banner is definitely coming back. But I think we kind of already knew that anyway. Um, there's going to be some cool emblems. We're going to have reputation bundles. And there is going to be a quest line. But I'm kind of hoping that there's more to the quest line than just talk to him and get on with it. Like, where has he been? Why is he not there with everybody right now? Um, something's keeping him away from, obviously, the events that happened when the Cabal attacked. Why? What, why was he not here? Why is he not here? I would love to know some backstory about it and hopefully that will come in the way of a quest. 
But as always, guys, you know, this isn't me just giving you information. It's a discussion. I would love to know what you think in the comments section down below. But for now, Guardians, that is going to wrap up the video. Drop a thumbs up. Subscribe to the channel for daily Destiny videos. But as always, thank you very much for watching. And until the next one, I'll catch you all soon.